Hi, this is another tips and tricks video for your list. And this one's all about hats. You know, I didn't really like hats. I didn't even wear hats when I had regular hair. And I, I thought, oh, you know, I, I always say I'm not a hat person. I've had so many girls come into my salon and say, well, that's cute, but I'm not a hat person. But darling, when you wear a wig, you're a hat person. I'm going to show you today. Whenever I would go with the girls and we'd go to a football game and then we'd go out to dinner, all the girls would rush at the restaurant to the restroom. And they'd take off their hat, fix their hair, back comb it, so forth, and come out. All of them except me. <laughs> because I didn't have to. The first thing, and I'm going to show you how. The first thing I want you to do with all of these hats I'm going to show you today is you start at the back to put it on your wig. If you go like this, then you might push your wig back and so forth. But right here, you're going to be able to set it perfectly. It's set in the back. Now, I don't have any glue. I don't have any tape or anything on my wig today. I wanted it to be a little loose so you could see with the hat, it's still comfortable. In fact, when you're here and you're drinking a little bit of hot toddy at the football game, not only do you look chic, but it keeps you warm and you don't have to worry about your wig falling off. I love it. This is just a regular little fedora. And a lot of times when I do this, you know, I'll pull out the hair a little bit. But here's the secret. We go into the restaurant, everybody sits down, and all the girls take off to the bathroom. And all I do is go like this. I'm going to do it real slow. Slide your finger, put it on the wig, take it off. There. The wig doesn't get flat like normal biological hair. You just shake your head, do like this, or nothing. If you have a bob on, it just stays. That's the great thing about wearing hats. Let me show it to you again, and I'm going to show you fast. Oh, are we ready to go to the game? Okay, guys, here we go. Oh, are we in the restaurant? Hi! See how fast that was? Nobody saw that I put my finger up there and really did. Now you practice a little bit. Let me show you another hat that's cute. This is the standard little French beret. Start at the back and see how I'm pulling it because I'm, I'm kind of holding my wig on. And then you don't even need a mirror. There you go. Okay, you're in the restaurant. See how nice and easy and it all stays up? It doesn't flatten down. And I trust me, I've done this where I wear a wig and then I wear the hat and I've gone to a football game and you sit there for three hours in the cold and still your hair doesn't flatten like everybody else's. Okay, let me show you just a couple of different ones so that you can get the idea. Now this is just a little tunnel cap. And when you're going to put something like this on, see how I've got my hands? I kind of put it in the hat, and then you bring it down. Chic. The hair's up. Look. Let's try another one. Oh, this is your little cloche. This is cute, too. Remember, put them in the back first. See how I'm holding it there? Then like this. A little bit of 1920s going on. I'm going to do it slowly. And bring it back so that your hair will go right back. Isn't that a great idea? So if you're not a hat person, but you think you might want to be a hat person, look on our website or look in stores wherever you go. Go to vintage stores. Go to the Salvation store and you can find lots of little hats like this. And what they do is they just set it off. And I always tell you this is the truth, the God's truth. If you have a hat or a ribbon or a clip or a brush or pull it up and clip it and do this and that, Nobody thinks you have a wig on. 
That's the great thing about it. You don't have to tell anybody, darling. Slowly, finger up. Good, huh? One more. That's my staple, of course. My little Panama hat. Now, start in the back. Come forward. Push my bang. Another great thing, you can get this with the tie here and it fits you. You can bring it down, you can bring it up, you can roll it, take it to the vacation. I love this thing. And another good idea is you wear scarves or you wear your little turbans and so forth. Put on a straw hat. Put on a hat over it. You'll be amazed at how chic you'll feel. Have a great day. Bye.